hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel welcome and go ahead and subscribe to my channel and turn on the post notifications so you will not miss every time that I post so I am making this video today because I have some great news yeah I am so 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 happy this is kind of like kind of like a dream like you know this is something that everybody wants that everybody wants to do and you know I feel like I'm you know I'm getting to the steps the steps that I want to do and things that I want to do so I have been taking classes for home ownership I have been taking classes for home ownership and I have finished my classes Yes, y'all, I have finished my classes. I am so happy. I had to take like 13 classes. For anyone that's out there, if you are want to be a, like you want to become a homeowner, I will say take these classes. And the reason why I would say take these classes because you learn so much. Like y'all, I learned so much. They teach you about credit. Um, they tell you, you know, pretty much like they, everyone should have a bank account, savings account, but I know some people, you know, not everyone has one, but it's best to have one. They teach you about savings. They teach you about payday loans. They, t they tell you it's so much that you can learn. They teach you about pretty much the process of what it is in home buying. Like I didn't know that it was so much that goes into buying a home you know what I mean it's like <clears throat> my mom didn't really teach me or tell me about credit like the only thing I was really told was don't get a credit card and this that, 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 that. and like I could see why because they even the people like they did say don't get a credit card but you have to be obedient like not exactly obedient but you have to be like careful like you can't just be out here because you got a credit card and I'm going to just throw an example out there, but just say like your limit is $1,000 and you just go and spend this whole $1,000, but you can't pay it back and then you get another credit card to pay off that credit card. Like you just putting yourself more in debt, like, you know what I mean? So, and plus when it comes to a credit card, you only supposed to spend no more than 30% of what whatever your limit is, you know what I mean? So... <clears throat> Y'all, I learned so much in these classes. I am so happy. So I finished my 13 classes. I am so happy. So my next objective is that I am meeting up. <clears throat> I am meeting up with someone and on Wednesday. And um, pretty much I was in a home ownership program. That's what I mean. I'm in a program. And um, it helps people like me who are first time home buyers. You know so and as you know like pretty much as you hear I'm going to be a first-time home buyer so they help people to get <clears throat> their first home and I am excited so I'm supposed to be meeting up with her on Wednesday as far as you know what's the next step that I need to do um pretty much I will be enrolled into actually getting into that the process of buying the first your first home so i know for a fact that i do have to um build my credit um i don't really i don't think i have no credit or maybe i do have credit i'm not exactly for sure but that's something that uh she she would help me with or talk to me about and uh i already have a bank i already bank with someone so what i'm probably going to do is go to my bank and talk to them about uh, getting a credit card so therefore I can start working on my credit and there's two type of credit cards that you can get you can get an unsecured credit card and a secure okay y'all so <clears throat> a secure credit card is when you take your own money so say for example you put two, you have $200 and you put it towards this credit card so pretty much what you do is it's still ten, it's still your money you still using it so what you do is you put the $200 onto the card and what you do is 
you say like you use $20 for gas. You know what I'm saying? So you'll swipe your card, use that $20 for gas, and then uh, you'll pay that $20 back within the time. So so that's another, one way that you can build your credit because not everyone can get an unsecured credit card, you know, especially if your credit's not good or you're just starting out and stuff like that. So what you'll do, you'll take your own money, you put it onto the car, use it, and once they see that you're building up your credit and once they see that, you know, okay, well, she'll pay it back, she'll do this, she'll do that, you know, well, I don't even just say she because it could be some he's that's watch some guys that's watching this but you know once they see that you can pay it back then they'll be like okay then they'll give you an unsecured credit card which means that you don't have to put no money towards it you know they'll tell you this is your limit so forth and so on and pretty much whatever you use you pay back you know so y'all it's so much that i've learned uh i am so happy you know uh, i believe i would be the first grandchild out of my generation you know that would own their first home so and plus you know i always wanted to be a homeowner because I, I have three children you know if you're new to my channel if you don't know this but i have three kids and i want my kids to be able to at least have you know have a roof over their head and they'll be good like because i already know like i have my time where god would say it's my time to go and hopefully my kids will be grown by that time but you know no, nobody knows when it's their time to go but um you know my kids will be able to at least have a house at least have somewhere to go if nothing else they have a roof over their head and i would teach my kids about taxes teach them about you know everything that you should know about being a homeowner and so y'all i just wanted to get on here and tell y'all that i finished my classes and on wednesday i will be meeting up with a person that i need to meet up with so I can get this on a road. So I'm hoping that <clears throat> pretty much like I can at least be in my home by the end of 2019. You know, so like I said, I just did the first process, which is, you know, taking the classes and getting everything that I need to get to learn about being a homeowner. Um, you got to save up. They teach you how to save. You know, it's different ways that you can save and so forth and so on but you know they just teach you things like things that you should already know but at the same time like some people may not know you know so even me like i know i'm supposed to save, but i i do but i don't but i'm about to really get into the saving because you want to save money anyway just because like you just never know your car might break down or any anything can happen like there's things that happen in life that you have no control over and you don't want to be stuck like how i'm gonna do this how i'm gonna do that no you know what i mean i have been stuck you know being uh, been in those kind of problems where i don't know what i'm gonna do like oh my god i'm gonna do this so if i would have had money saved up i wouldn't have that problem so anyways I just want to get on here and tell y'all that I am so excited. I am so happy. I will be bringing y'all along on the journey when it actually gets to the home. You know, me actually start looking for homes. So I will be bringing y'all along with me on that journey. You know, I just wanted to let y'all know, <clears throat> excuse me, that I have reached one of my milestones. And I am very, very excited about the situation. And if you want to know anything um about as far as when it comes to buying a home if y'all want to know or have any questions i will do the best of my ability to answer these questions i do have a whole lot of packets and stuff that they had gave me in the classes and stuff so um maybe i can i don't know how i will do it i do have like a instagram and a facebook where maybe i can take a picture of it and send it to y'all or something I, I don't know yet. Um, I haven't really gave out my Instagram information or my Facebook information, but um, just the, you know, if you want to know, just let me know. And I'm going to go ahead and close out this video. As y'all see, I am driving. It is Tuesday. Yesterday was a holiday. I was off work, so now it's back to the work spot. So. If you like this video, give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Once you subscribe, go ahead and turn on that post notification bell. That post notification bell will let you know every single time that I post. And until next time, and also leave a comment. You know, say congratulations. You know, I, I don't know. <laughs> you guys say congratulations, but just leave a comment if you have any questions or anything like that i can try the best of my ability to answer the question and if i can't answer the question then i can at least 
lead you to where you can get the answer to your question. So, until next time, this is Donisha's Life, and y'all have a great and blessed day.